Hey there, it's Andy with the Reverb Tone Report. Today we're taking a look at the new Aria compressor drive from Keeley Electronics. Always the trailblazer, Robert Keeley has connected two well-worn paths that many pedal makers have wandered before with the Keeley Aria compressor drive. These two Keeley tones have separately inspired countless musicians, but now they sit side by side in one versatile tool. At its core, the Aria compressor drive combines the tone and blend functions of Keeley's Compressor Plus with a wide range of clean boost and saturated overdriven tones. The drive side is a dual mode overdrive that spans anything from a neutral clean boost all the way to a mid-focused and smooth overdrive, just like you'd hear from the red dirt or white sands pedals. Whether stacked with the drive or all by itself, the Aria's compression side comes equipped with a clean blend and a tone control. Blend in any amount of clean signal for punchy rhythm sounds that maintain your guitar's natural attack, while the tone control can brighten up leads or subdue the compression effect. Much like the DNM drive, the Aria has two ways you can combine the two effects. Commonly, compression is put before overdrive in order to reduce noise. Sometimes added sustain and squishiness is required, which can be achieved by placing a compressor after an overdrive. Finally, the Aria compressor drive comes with TRS input jacks, allowing you to divide the pedal into two units. With this capability, you can insert effects in between the two sides, or integrate the Aria into your favorite pedal switcher and have complete control over when each effect is turned on. The Keeley Aria compressor drive runs on standard 9-volt power, is hand-built right here in the USA, and is available to you now on Reverb.com. So with a fair amount of compression and overdrive, let's see what happens when we switch the effect order. I'll start off in the conventional manner of compression into drive. Let's go over the clean blend function. I'll start with the knob all the way to the right, which is 100% compressed, and then I'll blend in the dry signal to add some natural attack back into the mix. Let's start off with a low gain slash clean boost on the drive side, and then I'll kick on some compression which is really invisible. And this is because I've used plenty of clean blend and I've rolled the tone back on the compressor. <laughs>
Next, I'll start with the medium gain overdrive and then kick on some compression before it to add some extra gain and brightness for a lead boost. <laughs> Here's your look at the Aria Compressor Drive from Keeley Electronics, and you can find this versatile two-in-one pedal right here on Reverb.com. Thanks for watching.